Oh God, I am like sweating all over, but it was amazing. Like, I'm so glad I've done it. And uh, now I'm on my way to the proactive um, event, so I need to get ready and get changed quickly. skin smoothing exfoliator um, this is your facial cleanser um, the beauty of this is that it's going to open up those pores ready for the more targeted treatments to put on there and so we want you to use that twice a day morning and night you don't want to overwash your face and so certainly no more than twice a day because overwashing can certainly dry out the skin a lot more okay and then to combine that we're going to use it with the with the skin brush Okay, oh, the nice. deep cleansing brush. Okay, and this I've got my own and this other one as well. So could I switch it up or, or you should certainly I can, use? You can, and there's no reason they're the same principle. Obviously, the proactive one has been designed to be used with yeah. products, but it's essentially the same, the same thing. And this is different speeds. Probably be, be best to when I use proactive, use just this brush to, to, so that all the products are in the same. same. Yeah, I agree. Absolutely. Um, only once a day for this because if you over stimulate <laughs> the skin by using one of these brushes, then you do too much cleansing. You can actually stimulate the grease glands, um, and which is not what we want to do. So you should be very gentle. Um, and that's the idea for. Um, Pattern your skin dry after you've washed your face as well, rather than just a big rubbing because you don't want to get those oil glands going as well. So if you wash your face with that one. Following on from using the, the skin smoothing exfoliator, we recommend using the toner. Okay. Uh, within there are some pads as well that you can use um, in order to, to use the toner and that's just going to remove the last debris that's on your skin it's going to finally open up any residual pores that haven't opened up and that's about, you know, we recommend using that along your neck and on the back of your neck as well um, and that will remove probably another 10 20 percent of the makeup and debris that you think you've taken yeah. off your skin yeah. so that's really i think good. that's what we've been missing definitely in so if you can introduce the upper toner that is the one thing that most people tend to I forgot, find yeah the side I've definitely they're... been the one Following from that, we have the poor targeted treatment. Okay. And so this is the one that's got the salicylic acid in that's going to get down into those pores and it's going to try and keep them open and it's also going to try and reduce any inflammation that's going on from the bacteria that are there. Yeah. 
so that's the next step. So as soon as you're out of the shower, that one, use yeah. that in the shower, a quick dash with your toe now to make sure you've got it all on, and then put that one on. Okay. And give that sort of five minutes to sink in before you put your moisturiser on. All right. Okay. So you don't need to be afraid of using moisturiser. A lot of people hate using moisturiser because you've got greasy skin because mm. it's going to make them more greasy. No, I like, I like <laughs> some moisture. For me, usually, I f and the, uh, after washing my face, I feel like I need moisture That's it. anyway. It still feels very yeah, dry, it feels it? quite dry. So, um, but this is one that is, uh, the word that we talk about is non-comedogenic, um, non-pore blocking, non-comedogen mm. forming. Um, and that's why this is really good because it's uh, going for going to um, complement the regime, mm. put some moisture back into the skin but without sitting on the skin. Mm -hmm. And again, another five minutes and then you're ready to go with your, with your makeup on. It's Amazing. Okay. So every morning and evening, that's what every you recommend? Every morning and evening, ideally, okay. if you can. Um, we're going to give you the wipes as well. So if you are in a hurry, um, mm -hmm. you know, if you're out of the gym or whatever, then by all means just instead of using the exfoliator if you can't get to a sink then you can wash your face with the wipes Amazing. I'm so glad I can use the wipes as well really really sunny so I've just uh, reapplied my makeup uh, because I can't can't be seen outside with like all the <laughs> can't be seen outside <laughs> like the way I just uh, have been seen by all of these girls but yeah I'm really really excited to be working with Proactive um, hopefully you are too to follow my journey um, is it going to be six months did you say yeah six months so super excited been, my skin has been so terrible like this week um, so it was like ideal for me to come in here and get my skin assessed and get the products and actually start the treatment tomorrow so yeah super excited thank you girls <laughs> thank you for having me <laughs> everyone's gone I'm like the last one here like super excited this evening I am on my way to uh, this blogger event that's called uh, Go Glam Gut go glam gala um, so we had to dress up so I've got this dress from uh, rare London um, I think it's cute it's a bit open here but I mean I guess that's the point and it's kind of nice detail here it's all gold uh, the colors are a bit weird on this camera in um, in the house it goes a bit yellowy but it is gold and that's black and I'm really really upset because <laughs> my shoes just didn't arrive on time I've had uh, a pair of shoes uh, that were meant to be delivered by 3 p.m. today and it's like 7 and it's not been it's just didn't deliver so um, I found these other shoes which are just a bit boring but I guess I'm just gonna have to wear them it's not the end of the world um, but yeah I'm looking forward to it really excited um, never be apparently it's meant to be like the biggest blogger event ever I'm gonna get going now because yeah I just don't want to be too late and arrive on time so I'm at Westminster station now. It's actually that cold that I'd rather wait inside the station because <laughs> it's so it's literally like so cold and I'm wearing like it's, yeah it's just way too cold to be outside. So I'm basically um, ready and I'm just waiting for Gabriel and Bianca. Um, they're running late as usual, so I'm just gonna wait literally until they get here and then we'll go outside. I saw on the Go Glam Gala uh, hashtag. And some of the outfits, so super excited for tonight. But yeah, I'm just gonna literally stand here and wait.
but I had a wonderful night um, seeing all the girls and yeah just catching up really it's always always fun I don't know if the camera's focusing on me but it was really really fun uh, always nice to see the girls and I think I'll end my vlog here I hope you enjoyed it uh, just a bit of fun really nothing major had a few glasses of red wine really enjoyed myself and I'll see you guys in the uh, next vlog